Hello, thank you for your interest in becoming a reviewer for the Community Housing Transformation Center. In this brief demonstration, I'm going to show you how to register as an external reviewer and how to complete a sample review. Go to our website, center.support, and click on Login on the top right. Alternatively, you can also go to community.center.support directly. Begin by logging into the community portal with your existing account or click on Don't have an account to create one. Click on Allow and on our portal click on Become an external reviewer in the sidebar. The landing page for Become an External Reviewer details what a reviewer does. External reviewers read through submitted applications and provide feedback. Your feedback will be incorporated in the project evaluation. Applicants will therefore benefit from your in-depth knowledge of certain aspects of the application. Reviews are confidential. Only center administrators know who reviewed an application. As I will show you in a moment, you will always be able to decline a review should its timing not be convenient for you or if you're not at ease with the topic or organization in question. If you accept the review, you will have 14 days to complete it. You can click on Apply at the bottom of this information section to start creating your reviewer profile. You will get an error message if you have not yet completed your user profile. In that case, click on the Go to User Profile button and check that you provided the obligatory phone number and job title on your profile. Once the error message is resolved, click on Apply. It is important to fill out the application in one sitting, which should take about 10 minutes. I will show you how to go back and edit your answers in a few moments. Click on Continue when you're ready. For this video, I will now create a sample reviewer profile. I don't identify as an indigenous person. I have experience in nonprofit housing and supportive housing. My areas of expertise are support services, social inclusion, and housing development and redevelopment. I have worked for 10 years as a manager for a nonprofit housing provider, would feel comfortable evaluating projects regarding new services, assessment, and strategic planning. I have worked with single parent families, persons living alone, low income households, and women. I'm particularly familiar with housing in Ontario and Quebec. I worked in both urban and rural housing and feel comfortable reviewing grant proposals in both French and English. Please use the text box at the end to provide more detail on your topic of expertise and the kind of projects you would like to review. Once you filled out all the answers, you can click on Apply. This immediately adds you to the external reviewer list. Make sure to add info at center.support to your email safe center list or to your contact list so that your first review assignment is not diverted to your spam folder. At this point, you can click on Return to Homepage. From here, you can click on External Reviewer in the menu. Two new sections will appear below. The first is your Reviewer Profile, which contains the information you just entered. If you want to go back to change something, you can just click on Reviewer Profile, edit what you would like to adjust on the next page, click on Save, and your profile has been updated. Please update your profile as you gain new experience and expertise as this helps us assign the right projects to you. Click on Return to Homepage. The second section allows you to access any reviews assigned to you. You will receive an email notification if a review has been assigned to you. We ask that you accept or decline a review within three business days. If you don't have time to even look at the project, please still decline the review. This lets us know we must reassign it. To do so, click on Assigned Reviews. Any reviews assigned to you will appear in this list. Click on the check mark below Process the Review. Confirm that you will comply with our Code of Ethics. 
Click on Next Page. This page provides an overview of the project that you have been assigned to review. This information should provide you with sufficient background to determine if you have the appropriate expertise to review the proposal and to declare that this assignment does not put you in conflict with the Ethical Conduct Agreement. Make the appropriate selection and decide whether you commit to review the project. Both boxes must be checked to complete the acceptance process. Click on I accept to review the proposal. Once you accept the due date, 14 days later, will appear on the Assigned Reviews page. At this point, you can either leave the page or click on Go to the Review to start the review process. This page shows the application to review on the left. On the right, you will see the questions you have to fill out to complete your review. These questions will vary depending on the type of project you are evaluating. You can download or print the application by clicking on the printer icon at the top left. The application includes the name of the program manager that you can contact in case you have any questions regarding the application. The review should take you anywhere between 1 and 2 hours. Though only the pick list questions are required, we ask for additional comments since we value your expertise. If you want to return to your review later, make sure to click Save at the bottom of the page. For this video, I will quickly select an answer to all obligatory questions. The activities are defined with details missing. The project has met three of the qualifications of transformational impact for the organization, community or sector. The proposal presents the gaps in service and the need but does not elaborate on the context. The applicant doesn't have sufficient partnerships to match the scale and scope of the project. The project hasn't demonstrated any of the above characteristics of feasibility. This project will address the identified need. I would recommend the application for funding, but with concerns. Once you have completed your review, make sure to click Submit. The relevant program manager will be notified that you have submitted your review and will incorporate your feedback into the project evaluation. Thank you for supporting the Centre with your generous and important contribution. We look forward to working with you and invite you to contact us if you have any additional questions.